On August 28, 1955, while visiting family in Money, Mississippi, 14-year-old Emmett Till, an African-American from Chicago, was brutally murdered for allegedly flirting with a white woman, Carolyn Bryant. Carolyn's husband, Roy Bryant, and brother-in-law, J.W. Milam, abducted Till at gunpoint from his great-uncle's home. He was brutally beaten, shot, and thrown into the Tallahatchie River with a cotton gin fan around his neck to ensure that his body remained submerged. Despite this, his corpse was recovered after three days, but was so disfigured that he could only be identified by an initialed ring. Till's mother, Mamie Till Mobley, made the bold decision to have an open casket funeral, allowing the world to witness the horrific brutality inflicted upon her son. Despite overwhelming evidence, the killers were acquitted by an all-white jury. The outrage and disgust sparked by Till's murder and the subsequent lack of justice helped to mobilize the civil rights movement.